Hi and welcome everybody, my name is Chris from Teacher and Student and in this video I will show you how to recover unsaved Excel documents super easy and guaranteed. What sometimes happens is that you work on an Excel document and your computer suddenly shuts down and you obviously never had the chance to save your document. Or what also sometimes happens is exactly what I'm doing right here with my example document. I have created some important tables and I click on close but then accidentally select don't save instead of save. Happens to all of us but don't worry, everything you do on your computer is saved somewhere. It is just a matter of finding the location and recovering it. Let's do it for our Excel document together. So I close my Excel document and accidentally hit don't save instead of save. Now, if we want to recover the file, we have to open our Excel application again and click on the Open tab in the left-hand navigation. If you have an older Excel version, you can get here by opening a blank document, then select the File tab in the top bar and click on Open in the left-hand navigation. That gets you exactly to the same spot where you will see a little button at the bottom of the page saying recover unsaved workbooks. When we click on the button, we get a pop-up window that leads us to the folder where all our unsaved Excel files are located. And we can also see the file that I just accidentally closed. All we have to do now is double click on the file and it will open in Excel displaying all our beautiful work that we didn't save before. Now you would go ahead and save it as normal Excel document as you would usually do. So this recovering option that I just showed you works in I would say 99% of the cases. If you're one of the few people where it didn't work I will show you another way that will work perfectly for you. What we have to do is find the Excel recovery folder manually. To do that, you open Excel. Actually, let me just close this one. Open Excel again and go to any document you might have or I just pick a blank document. Then we select the File tab in the top bar and click on Options in the left-hand navigation. In the Excel Options pop-up window, you select the Save tab. Here we can now find the exact location from where we can recover all our unsaved Excel files following this path. So all we have to do is highlight the path like so and copy the path. Then we open File Explorer, which you can search in your Microsoft search bar. And having opened that, we click in the path field and paste the path that we just copied in it. Okay, now don't forget to press enter and there you go. You can see all your unsaved Excel files. Like I explained before, now you just have to double click on the file and it will open nicely in Excel for you to be finally saved correctly. If this also did not work for you, it is very likely that you don't have the Excel auto recovery settings enabled. So let's quickly check the settings together as well. We are in our Excel sheet and click on file, then on options all the way down here again. And now under the save tab, we have to make sure that all these three checkboxes are checked. Otherwise you won't be able to recover your file. While we are here, let's also change the time it takes to save information from the default 10 minutes that you have most likely in your options right now down to one minute, which I already have here. Once you have enabled all these settings, don't forget to click on OK. And now look, if you haven't had this enabled this time, the next time your computer crashes or anything happens, your Excel files will definitely be recovered. It might be a good idea though to just check if your settings are working fine using an example file that you can just quickly create now. But that's how easy it is to recover unsaved Excel files. I hope this video helped you. If you like more of these videos, please feel free to subscribe to my channel. Take care and see you soon.